us now see the comparison of the plant cell and the animal cell that is plant cell versus animal cell right now when we talk about the plant cell and the animal cell plant cells have got cell walls so cell wall is present in plant cell whereas cell wall is absent in the animal cells when we talk about plastids like leucoplast chromoplast plastids are present in plant cells whereas plastids are absent in the animal cells when we talk about centrioles and centrosomes centrioles and centrosomes are absent in the plant cell but centrioles and centrosomes are present in the animal cell when we talk about vacuoles vacuoles are large and less in number in the plant cell when we talk about animal cell vacuoles if present they are small and many in number some more points like uh, plant cell the nucleus lies on one side of the cell because there is a large enough vacuole which pushes the nucleus to one side whereas in the animal cells the nucleus lies at the center of the cell when we talk about plant cells the cell is rigid when we talk about animal cell it's flexible when we talk about plant cells the golgi contains dictyosomes and in animal cells golgi contains dictyosomes in the form of vesicles plant cells are larger in size animal cells are smaller in size is a comparison between the plant cell and the animal cell you know starch is stored in plant cells whereas glycogen is stored in the animal cells at as food let us now move on to the structures of the plant cell and the animal cell respectively mm -hmm.